So we are in Madagascar, we're in Manga Bay Protected Forest and we've got a group of 12 of us out here helping Madagascar Vakatchi with their um, surveys of the Golden Mantala Frog. Madagascar Vocat is a Madagascar conservation organisation um, that promotes like, conservation and sustainable use of um, uh, natural resources, especially endemic species in Madagascar. What we do with Chester Zoo with Madagascar Vukachi is, is an assemblage of uh, sharing the experience and the technical uh, knowledge on how to monitor amphibians in the wild. So the major objective is to know how many frogs we can find in a pond. What is the population size? The team goes in the same standardized way along the transit collecting every single frog and then what we do is processing uh, three major questions is one is it's a new capture or it's been recaptured be marked for the days uh, months before second is we take the body mass and the third is about the snow ventral length so basically the length of the animal the expedition in itself I, th I think it's really important because not only it helps us uh, and works that we should have done in a month, we could do it in um, just two weeks. We've also been surveying primates and we've been helping with some local education work that Madagascar Vakachi run out here, as well as creating a bird list for the area. Today we're at Moramanga School in Moramanga and we've been here to talk to the children about what Chester Zoo does, working with animals and trying to help animals out in the wild as well. And so we did a presentation for the children and a really fun educational activity uh, to explain to them what we do and why we're in Madagascar. The children were incredibly well behaved throughout the presentation. They sat and they listened and they took it all in. They asked loads of questions, really, really good questions about all the animals, where they live, any conflicts between humans and animals. Children were happy to learn about animals, to discover animals they have never seen. And the most important is they have learned about the Montella frog's habitat. Uh, you have to they need a uh, clean and a uh, forest habitat, so I think it was um, good. When we head out in the morning to do some bird watching, um, we head out nice and early, first light if possible. Uh, we look around camp um, to start with, to see what's right on our doorstep. Previously it's been a main focus on the herp and the primates so um, so it's the first look really at, uh, at the birds around this protected area. Vokaji really needs the list of uh, local birds here because they will open this area like a private reserve. Villagers park. That will then lead to pulling in some uh, some ecotourism for um, focusing on birding. The interactions between the team uh, in Vokadi and um, and from the Chester Zoo, I think it just increases the confidence between the friendship and knowledge between the teams, um, uh, the confidence of the team in Madagascar because they never, rarely we can get to meet the funders, the partners, so I think this one is really important. Of course, here at the zoo we keep golden mantellas, and so we've been looking and working with um, Madagascar for actually some time in the surveys. So actually, to take the practical skills that the guys have developed here, particularly in the marking of frogs and the handling of frogs, uh, and be able to help uh, Madagascar for actually do that in the field is just a really nice link between what happens in the zoo and what happens in Madagascar. <laughs>